Hello out there, everyone in YouTube land, Brother Ellen Inslee here with another dose of the truth. The reason for this video is simple. According to the next news network, Gary Franchisi, Obama has once again acted above and beyond his legal capacity as well as illegally by authorizing the sale of enough nuclear uranium to make 10 nuclear weapons. He is straight out blatantly in direct violation of the oath of office he took. Can someone please, please tell me why this post, why this guy has not been impeached for treason before now? And why it doesn't seem he's going to be locked up for treason? Him or Hillary or CNN or MSNBC or ABC or Fox or any other of the other fake news networks. When all they've done is lie, in high school, slander, I was, I was and with her as assassinate, father. or at least attempt to assassinate, and Trump's and good and name, and as well as sell nuclear material, material to our enemies and try to start a third world war, which will be the end of the world because of nuclear weapons. Please, somebody, wake up, America, wake up, wake up, and see what is going on. Wake up, stand up, be a man. Be a woman, be an adult, and say, no more will we sit back and allow our government to strip away our rights in the name of security. No more will we allow our government to invade our privacy in the name of security. No more will we allow the government to tell us how to live our lives in the name of security. No more! You could get a refund advance of up to $1,250, no interest at block. Do you, do you realize that the average no. Do you realize that the amount of places where there's a mass shooting is always around airports, schools, government buildings, places where we used to be able to carry handguns and now under the law can't? And it only started happening after Obama got in office and he stripped us of the right to carry our weapons in those places. Had there been someone with a whip with the gun doing that false flag operation called Fort Lauderdale shooting, I can guarantee you that man never would have gotten up any more than one, maybe two rounds before someone shot him. So he can be said for saying the jerk, a roar, all the others. But on the subject of Fort Lauderdale, please, America, wake up and see that it's a false flag operation. Come on, it comes right on the hills of a video coming out where it blatantly shows four black people torturing, assaulting, maiming, and attempting to murder a handicapped white man. 
and they're screaming death to Whitey, F Whitey, F Donald Trump. And they weren't going to get hate crimes until every white person and a few black said it should be a hate crime. Because if it was reversed, it would be. Please, wake up and see that the Fort Lauderdale shooting was just a false flag operation to get your mind off of the fact of those four black people that tortured, kidnapped, beat a white, mentally handicapped man. Please. See the truth. Please. No. The truth. And pass the sign. Don't take my word for it. Look into it. Make it your own mind. But from what I'm saying, it's a pretty clear cut case of. Misdirection. You find out about the video immediately a Fort Lauderdale shooting happened so that the people that got in trouble over the Chicago video could quietly get washed under the rug, pushed under the rug, left it under the rug. Nothing happens to them, they just kind of get forgotten about. Because in Obama's eyes and all the other, a majority of the black people's eyes, black lives matter, but not white. Well, if that's the case, then white lives matter, not black. It's all about equality. You want equality? You want respect? Those are two-way streets. You want equality? That's in everything. That means if you can call me a whitey or a cracker, I could call you a black person or an N word. I know it's good. I'm not going to be politically correct. You call me a whitey, a cracker, a honky, I could call you a spook, a coon, a nigger. That is true equality. Simple. Done. That's equality. Uh, please see what is going on and let's change it let's help Donald Trump do his job and make America great again let's help get Obama out now and strip him of all his power before he does Maybe even arrest him for treason. Anything so he can't make any more laws. And kick him out of office now. So that nothing can bad, bad can be done to hurt our country again. Well, I thank you for watching this. As usual, if you like it, hit the like button, subscribe to it, just so you know, I have no sponsors, I'm making the videos, every day as I see stuff, and going from there, go thank you, and have a nice day.